friends, it's Tracy and Violet from Nova Scotia Living. It's the next day, or oh, it's a new video, probably a new video because it's going to be a long video today, probably. It's our big fat Thanksgiving. It's Saturday. Um, it's 5.56. We got up about a half hour ago, went for a walk. Boris must be up with one of the kids. Um, I got Harriet, my big pot out there on the stove going with macaroni in it. And we're going to make macaroni this morning. I have a lot of stuff to do. I need to make that peel a pot of potatoes. Fold laundry that's out there. Oh, I gotta go rotate laundry too. I put I'm gonna do that now. I'll be right back. There, I switched that over. I have laundry to fold this morning too, so the kids can go put it away. Um I have a turkey in the oven from last night. I put it in at 260. I just bumped it up to 350 just while I have my coffee. Then I'm gonna take it out. And, yeah, I'm going to have my coffee and check that macaroni in about 10 minutes. All right, I finished that coffee in five minutes. I'm not even exaggerating. It's probably a two coffee morning. I'm not going to have it now, maybe after if I get a little low. But that's the macaroni. I'm going to get another pot out and start making a roux. All right, I put some butter in there. I'm going to melt it, throw some flour in there, thicken it, and slowly start adding some milk and spices. I'm going to put some dry mustard, some salt and pepper, some cheese, and some hot sauce. Oh, I need to get out my jalapenos. Just a minute. Oh, I need to wash these and cut them up. I'm going to put them in with this butter to start softening. Then I'll start adding the flour. All right, I'll soften those peppers for a bit. Then I'm going to throw some flour up in here. Okay, this is softened up enough. Um, I'm going to throw some flour in. I got a whisk. I got some cheese. Uh, I need to get the milk out. I thought I had it out. All right, I made a cheese sauce. Um, I didn't put mustard powder. I put actual yellow mustard in here too with cheese and garlic powder and uh, onion powder and those jalapenos. I gotta find some franks. I gotta throw some franks up in here. Anyways, I gotta clear off this table. Under there is cupcakes, homemade rolls, and lemon meringue pies, but I need working space. There's the macaroni, so I need to do this. Alright guys, it's 6.33. I am going to, uh, there's the sauce, there's the noodles, there's the pans. I'm not going to bake it now, I'm going to bake it later today, but... I just want to assemble it. I should actually get um, something to put these on after because it's going to be hot stuff. It's going to be hot. And just that sauce is hot, the macaroni is hot. I wasn't planning on making two, but I'm terrible at cooking pasta and never know how much to cook. So, I'm going to focus on one, but I'm sure I have enough for two. And if I have two, I will put one in the freezer. That's all there is to it. And then after this, um, I have stuff in the dryer. I put that the pies and stuff out on the deep freezer right there. I covered it up just like how I had it covered before. I want to wait for that dryer to be done so I can fold up all that stuff. So I'm probably going to peel a pot of potatoes. Peel a pot of potatoes. All right. Maybe I should get a scoop. I got out my food processor too because I do need to shred more cheese today and if I need some more for this but I need some for broccoli and cauliflower and cheese so I might as well just do it now and be done with it um 
I'm using all this sauce, even though I might have too much, it'll be fine. I can't hold on to more stuff. I can't be bothered with this. I do have some cheese here I'm gonna mix up all in it so when I go to officially bake this later I have jalapeno Cheetos I'm gonna crunch some up and put them on top I hear somebody moving around upstairs Um, last night I was supposed to go get Maze at a sleepover, but he really wanted to stay. I started to go, but then the mom messaged me, and he seemed to be doing fine. I said, okay, if you need me in the night, um, that's fine. He does have hockey today at 10 o'clock, so that's why I wanted to try to get a lot of this done so I can go to that. I want to get another turkey in before I leave. And from 10 to 11. No horsing around or anything, just go in. That way I can have this mac and cheese then, get another turkey in the oven, get a pot of potatoes peeled. Oh, I need to get some slow cookers going with the corn and peas. I'll do that this morning before I leave. Um, yeah, I want to dig out my steamer pots for the cauliflower and broccoli. I won't do that till later this afternoon, though, but I could dig out the pots so they're at the ready. But yesterday we got the deviled eggs done. We got cupcakes, lemon meringue pie, pumpkin spice cheesecake. I still need to make cinnamon um, whipped cream to go with the cheesecake. But I have Dream Whip. I'm assuming I can use that. I don't know. I'm about to get the dishwasher going right after this. looking fine fine has like tint of orange I could throw turmeric in here and make it super orange like craft dinner but I'm not going to um gonna mix this cheese up in it. Oh, there's a big chunk. I'll just poke that down in. Some lucky person will get that. I've used Velveeta cheese in the past, like specifically for this for Thanksgiving, but I didn't get any this year. I forgot to be honest. And I just see a lot of people in the States use Velveeta cheese. It's just really expensive here. I mean, cheese is expensive anyways, but it's quite expensive. Alright, I want that down in. 
and I will probably put more cheese on top later when I go to bake it. But I'm not baking it now. And one of these will go in the freezer, probably. Perfect. All right, I'll get you off so you can get a good look at these. All right, I'm filling that cheese pot full of water. It can't fit in the dishwasher, but that's all right. I'll just wash it. So again, it'll be, I'll sprinkle more cheese on top when it goes to bake with some of those crunchy jalapeno uh, Cheetos, but it'll just be kind of like dust and we'll get a nice crust on top. Not hard, not like dried out, but just a little bit. All right, there's the cheese for later. I'm just gonna put it in the fridge. This is the turkey I put in last night at 260. Just bumped it up for about an hour. It's about 20 after 7 now. Um, there's the potatoes. Look, we put the onions in. Looks like two boobies. And you see, usually I cook it breast down. I'm going to take this out because I have another turkey to cook. And I'm going to wash it, stuff it with onions, line it with uh, carrots at the bottom and onions. You can see those in there. This is going to go on a platter and I'm going to cover it, cover it for a few hours. All right, I strained the drippings. I'm going to make a gravy with that. There's the turkey. I have butter and stuff all under in the breast. I'm cooking it breast down so it looks funny. And some salt and poultry seasoning and onion and stuff. So, Mazaya and her friend Maddie just woke up. Say good morning. Good morning. <laughs> uh, yeah, so this is going to go in the oven now. Oh, my flash. Okay, this is where my Ninja air fryer usually is in my toaster. I just put them out in the laundry room so I can put these slow cookers here. I'm going to put frozen corn and frozen pea, add some water, and let them go all day long. And, um, yeah, that'll two, be two more things off my list. When you call my name you know that song anyways i just cleaned up there there was like the old pie shell box lemon meringue box i'm not doing a deep clean but i did um there's that there's that i'll get a scoop for it after that's that runner i got at the dollar store the other day and over here are the potatoes the carrots from yesterday the turkey's in the oven this is the drippings from the turkey i just took out i'm gonna make a gravy 
there and the gravy I made yesterday and this one I'll add together in a slow cooker and put it on keep warm. So yeah, I'm just going to turn this on when it comes to a roll and boil, add this in, stir it up till it thickens and then that's it. All right, this is the gravy I did last night. Um, I'm going to put it in here. I just washed the slow cooker and then I'll add the other drippings and I'm just going to keep it on, keep warm and I'll stir it occasionally today. Um, but that way that's off my list. friends it's 20 after 9 I just had a shower quick shower my hair is still all wet I'm I'm gonna go in and meet uh, Joanna that's Maze's friend's mom at the hockey rink for 945 uh, the dishwasher's going the turkey's still in the oven you know all that sort of thing it's still fine um, I'm not going to any stores I told Misha like just stay here and finish cleaning your room I'm not going to Tim Hortons I'm not going to the dollar store I'm going to hockey and coming home, so let's let's boogie. All right, I made it to the rink. I don't know if they're here yet or not, but it's uh, 9.38, so I'm going to go in and make sure I wear my hat because my hair is still wet. All right, they're not here yet, so I just dropped the bag in one of the rooms, and I'll go way to the front for them. All right, 9.59. Oh, this is fuzzy. Perfect timing. All right, it's all done. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna stop to Tim Hortons. My husband just said he wants a coffee, so I'll stop and get one, and then I'm heading right home. All right, Mally's making that Oreo cheesecake. Um, I'm gonna cut up this ham. This is that second turkey I put in this morning. That's done. The one I just deboned. Yeah, I'm gonna slice this up and put it on here and sweat it in the oven for a bit. All right, Mally's still making the, I'm just showing the bowl, not getting you, the cheesecake. I have two boxes of this, Dream Whip. Oh. Anyways, um, I had three envelopes left in this. I'm going to make three of plain whipped dressing and then three of cinnamon whipped dressing for my pumpkin spice cheesecake because we'll need some for the Oreo cheesecake and the pudding tarts if we still do that. I just want to show you this before it goes in the fridge. That's M Mally's Oreo cheesecake. It looks so friggin' good. 
All right, so there's the plain. I just put the, the vanilla. I'm gonna do another three envelopes, but sprinkle some cinnamon in there too. All right, there's the cinnamon with cream. Um, these are done. I just turned them on medium while I was doing the whipped cream and stuff. They're done. So I'm gonna take them out, strain them, I'll not whip up the potatoes and deal with the carrots and then find something to put them in. All right, it's 12.45. Um, I have been, uh, I just took this out of the oven. This is potato, no, this is a cornbread dressing. I, a cornbread dressing um, I made yesterday. I thought it was the potato one. There's two potato ones in there warming up now. And I will rotate them about every 20 minutes. Because I don't want them to really cook. I just want them to maintain their heat. I had flipped this ham over. That was been in for about maybe a half hour. But you can see where it's kind of not dried out. But I don't know. Sweat a bit. So it's still moist. But it has a little bit of char. A little bit. I'm going to put this in one of those buffet silver things. Actually I'm going to get that out now. Just the containers so I can get this pan washed. I'm trying to get everything washed before grub time. Mmm, that's a little chunk. Maze is going to be my taste tester. This is one of the buffets. I have two of them. The other one has like a clear top. Let me know how it is. It is hot. <laughs> Blow on it. Good. Alright, so this will probably take up two of these. And I might actually put some turkey in. I haven't decided yet. I'm going to put the corn, carrots, and peas in my other buffet. So I'm going to see what I can do here. All right, it all fit in one perfectly. So that works out good. Now this, these, these come out. It's this bottom plate that you turn on. And I can just plug it in and put it on warm. Uh, not to cook, but just to keep it warm. Um, I'm not going to do that right now though. This is still very hot, but it's in the container. And when I steam broccoli and cauliflower, I'm thinking I'm going to put those in there. And then corn, peas, and carrots will be in the other buffet. The turkey I will have in these trays along with the dressing and stuff. Okay, these are those little tarts. Ma uh, Mazaya and Madeline are going to do the pudding up. It's just instant pudding. But these need to bake for... Oh gosh. I tear the directions. It's 375. Uh, thaw in room for 10 minutes. Bake 8 to 10 minutes at 375. Let cool completely. Okay. Well, the oven was at 350. I just bumped it up to 375. So I'll wait a few minutes. And then we'll stick them in the oven for eight to ten minutes. Let them cool, and then this is just three cups of milk. It's instant pudding, and then we can top them with whipped cream when it comes time to eat. Easy peasy. All right, I almost forgot about these. I haven't done the potatoes yet, but I put some butter, some salt, some sugar—not a whole bunch, but a little bit—and mixed it up. I'm going to put it in one of those buffet things.
right, guys, we've been busy. It's 2 o'clock now. Um, those potatoes were done. I whipped them up with salt and pepper and butter and milk. I'm just going to cover them with foil and put it in the oven. The oven's off, but it's warm in there. Those tarts are done. Um, the gravy's good. Here are the carrots, the peas, and the corn. Um, butter, sugar, salt, and pepper. Butter, salt, and pepper. Butter, salt, and pepper. So, and I store the gravy once in a while. Um, what else? Hmm. Dishwasher's going yet again. I'm wa I washed the two slow cookers. Oh, my husband's down there with Misha and Maze. I caught a salamander. He's bringing down some more of that bush. Yeah, I washed the turkey roaster. I washed the two slow cookers. I'm going to wash Harriet there. So I can put that all away. Because there will be plenty of dishes to do tonight. But this stuff I won't have to do. It'll be done. I... I'm leaving the gravy in that slow cooker because it just keeps it warm. It's fine. And everything else can fit in the dishwasher. Like, I mean, a turkey roaster would fit in the dishwasher, but I don't want to, you know, use up that much space when I can put a lot of little things in there. But yeah, Misha brought in the punch stuff to make punch. It's too early to make it now. And I'm going to get the pots out after for the steamed broccoli and cauliflower and Mazzaia needs to come down and make that chocolate pudding for the tarts that are done. So we're getting there. Oh, and I forgot to show you these are the drippings from that second turkey I cooked today like the one I put in this morning. I'm not going to bother making gravy today with it because I'll use that to make more gravy for leftovers because I think I got plenty of gravy for today. All right I'm going to debone this bad boy. It's still warm but it's sat over an hour. Um, I'm gonna get side to do these soon. It's almost three o'clock. I just don't want to do them too early. I don't got room in the fridge to keep them. Um, brought out some dishes. Ugh, the dishwasher's doing its thing, but uh, some of my fancy dishes. Um, Mal Misha put knives and forks on the tables, but those ones I'll put in whatever dish. Dessert plates, bowls. I might use that for something. I'm not sure, but yeah all right so this is the before that'll be the after all right there's the after get your paws out of here she's already had a couple of pieces Those are done. Um, Maddie didn't really want to be filmed, like, to see her face or anything, so she, I had it pointed down. But, yeah, I might lick the bowl, actually. Uh, the girls are just taking Violet and Boris out for a bit, because I feel bad. I haven't been able to go sit outside with them or anything. But I can't put these in the fridge. I'm going to try to find some place cooler than my kitchen to put them. And then when we go to eat them, some of that whipped cream will go on top. And I've, this dishwasher will be the last one um, before supper. I also got a scoops and things that I'll need. Um, I need to put this in the fridge. But I just took those out, winter vegetables. It's 326. Supper is at 5. So, so I have a little time. Winter vegetables, broccoli and cauliflower. I'm going to steam them. This stove actually has like a melt or er, warm zone. I have that turned on and I have this 
burner over here on melt. I've never used it before. So um, I'm hoping it helps. Then I have a whack of stuff in here. So. So, um, deviled eggs, and this will be like for some of those trays, along with that. The gravy will stay in the slow cooker right here. All of the dishes will be over there. Um, yeah, I had to figure out how to break these up because they're like the three prong ones. Uh, so that's what I'm doing. I, the light on this one isn't coming on. So, I don't know if it's still working. I've had this for, oh God. I don't know how long. Oh, maybe it's not working because of this. Now it's working. Oh, Tracy. So, these two will have the broccoli and cauliflower and cheese and the ham. And the corn, and peas, and carrots. Ooh, all my flash is on. Um, I had to unload my phone again. So this is just a white tablecloth, a cloth one actually. And Misha's just gonna do this one up. All right, we're listening to 80s jams. I'll give you a little tour. I turned that lamp on over there. She's about to put forks and stuff down. But I have that on. Hello, sir. And then I'll turn the big light on just so you can see. We'll put that chair at the end here if we need to. And Maze has got to take his boots out to the porch. Yes. And that's where I put that mask on my fan. And upstairs is tidy, the bathroom's tidied there of course you gotta have a clean toilet right so excellent and now we'll go out in the kitchen the music's playing so I might have to stop it I'm gonna start working with that mac and cheese so I can put the Cheetos on it and here's some buns I made yesterday there's a whole thing of other extra buns and yeah we're good
All right, guys, I got music playing, so I'm talking loud. There's that mac and cheese with the Cheetos and cheese on top. It's warmed up. There's some potato dressing. There's some cornbread, chicken cornbread dressing. There's my beautiful skull platter uh, with deviled eggs. This is coleslaw. I just used the store-bought creamy coleslaw stuff. Okay, Google, pause the music. Um, anyways, put that there. Uh, potatoes. Everything's warmed up. Some more potato dressing. Oh, I got to get some spoons for the cranberry sauce. Two things of turkey. I got another bag of turkey in the fridge. The carrots, the peas, the corn, the ham, the broccoli and cauliflower and cheese. And yeah, I can't fit this over on the table, but some of my buns. I warmed up some butter, so, you know, if they want that. There's some salt and pepper there. And here's the gravy. There's the gravy. Give it a stir. There. Oh, my battery's... My da battery's low. Oh, no! I had a plate. It's hotter than the hinges in here. We got a full house, which is very exciting. All the chairs are taken and even in the living room. So awesome. Not everybody wants to be filmed, so I'm not going to film out there. But yeah, I'll get the desserts out in about 20 minutes. Let everybody finish their supper and stuff. And yeah, I'll be back. All right, everybody's finishing eating. It's 5.56. I just want to make up plates before I put the stuff away. This is for Saritha. There's mac and cheese, one potato ball, carrots, peas, corn, potato dressing, cornbread dressing. She told me not to send very much because she can't eat, so this will be a couple days worth. Some turkey, some ham, some cranberry sauce, two deviled eggs, some coleslaw, and a homemade bun. So, now I need to do dad up some stuff. 
All right, this one's for dad. So there's coleslaw, deviled eggs, mac and cheese, uh, carrots, peas, corn. Oh, just a minute. All right, so there's turkey for him. Oh, I don't have any ham. I gotta get some. And then potatoes, dressing, and gravy. All right, we're getting uh, desserts out. That's that pumpkin spice cheesecake. We're gonna cut it up. Misha or Mally decked out that with some more Oreos. Doesn't that look so professional? The lemon meringue pies, the chocolate tarts we'll put with cream on, and the cup of cakes. Uh, All right, here's that Oreo cookie one. It didn't get a chance to sit up it's super firm, but it'll still be good. The cinnamon whipped cream for the pumpkin spice, two lemon meringue pies, some cupcakes, and some chocolate tarts with some whipped cream on top. So, perfect, perfect. put Violet and Boris out there because Boris is acting like a doorknob and there's little people around. All right friends it's about 10 after quarter after nine our family just left um had a wonderful time wonderful time I would like to have filmed more but you know it's family time so Misha and I are going to pop over to Saritha's I just messaged her she's still up to bring over her plate dad took his with him and then I'm coming back and kicking my feet up. The second dishwasher's going of the supper dishes. I'll have another one with all the buffet stuff, but no big deal. Oh, I'll open the door. You got the food. The bundle. Did it? Oh, it's facing me. 
Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> Are you out? Oh, okay, you're in bed. Yeah. <laughs> well, good morning, friends. It's the next day. I'm going to put an ending on my big fat Thanksgiving video for once. So I'll put an ending on it before I just try to sit down to edit. But yeah, we had a wonderful Thanksgiving. Um, we had a nice crowd and there is leftovers, but not as many leftovers as I think last year because the past couple of years it's just it's been thrown off not everybody could come yesterday but we still had a nice house full and it, it was wonderful all the little cousins could play and i even met um a little little cousin that i have never met before and she's like three and she's so friggin adorable <laughs> yeah anyways totally remind me of evie like she's just a spitfire uh, running around and kind of forget what three year, three year olds are like and i'm just like oh my goodness a blast from the past but anyways it was it was wonderful and now today we're gonna clean up i did i think three loads of dishes last night before i went to bed i just unloaded the dishwasher from last night and i'll have at least one more like with the punch bowl and the other buffet those things and then i can put it all away and put the tables away and get the chairs up in the attic i'll get the kids to help me with that and yeah but yeah i hope you enjoyed hanging out with us i know all my american friends don't have your thanksgiving um until the end of november is it the 25th i don't know it's something like that like um this is more like a harvest uh harvest festival for us like the thanksgiving um just the celebration of the changing of seasons and you know uh, I think that's what our Thanksgiving is more about anyways Thanksgiving is Thanksgiving and I love it I love it and I think my friends in the UK you don't technically have a Thanksgiving do you but do you have any other celebrations you do big shindigs like this I don't know I I'm not that smart I really don't know <laughs> I don't know Anyways, I'm going to say peace, love, and happiness today and every single day. Please like, share, and subscribe if you so choose, but if not, that's okay too. I still love you. I still want all the happiness in the world for each and every one of you out there. I certainly do. I really, really honest and truly do. Yes, I do. So, okay guys, I'm about to have my Tim Hortons coffee. So, I'm going to say have a good night or have a good morning. And I will see you tomorrow.